Yo, what is up, YouTube? Today, I'm gonna be doing some legs. Let's get into this shit. Um, it's down the fucking pre. Got my Edge of Insanity pre workout. Strawberry watermelon. It's probably my favorite flavor, or um, blue lemonade. It's my favorite flavor. But, uh, anyways, let's get this shit. Let's down this pre. <coughs> Here we go. I don't recommend dry scooping. That shit just hit the back of my throat. Dry powder. That shit suck, but yeah. Do some squats today. Probably do a heavy double, single, some shit. Anyways, guys, let's get the shit. So I studied the fucking all these lifts, like how to do them to get like max fucking, you know what I mean? Straight power. Yeah. Max power. Well, usually you would do low bar, but I feel like doing high bar because it's fucking menace, so. Now, but I, what I do is I usually put, point my feet a little out, kind of open up my hips, and then fucking boom, down, and my back is tight, fucking, like my whole back, I'm squeezing my back tight, bracing, and fucking staying tight like a fucking elastic band, and it fucking... Ah, uh, just stop a little higher. <laughs> uh, I already fucked it up. That's alright. That heavier weight, I stop higher, so I just fucking... Oh, yeah. This weight, I lose you fucking... I'm just used to fucking boom! Bah! Because it's just like nothing. Yeah. Nothing compares. Nothing compares to this shit, bro. <laughs> I think that's like 350 something anyways. Probably. I don't even know what it is, I'll be honest. 245 plus the nut. Fucking butter. Huh? Butter. Yeah. <laughs> See, with the wraps, I'm used to stopping, like, higher because it hurts when you go super deep with them. Yeah, because it's pushing. Yeah. Cutting everything off. So fucking, it's great because now I know like, now I can stop good. When I don't have them on, I fucking just drop ass to grass. Yo. And it kind of, it's good to go ass to grass, but fucking. Not when you're. Not jumping. when you're doing like 900 fucking pounds, you know. <laughs> you Unless you're joking. I went a little back into you. You straight though. I was good. I, yeah. didn't, I didn't want to push you forward. Now you're good. All right. I was trying to fucking pull you back a little. Now you're good. Right. You gotta fuck up your reps, man. No, you're straight. All right. That's no, fine. I went back, and I was like, well, I I went back like initially just to fucking keep myself up, and then you pulled, which was fine. Keep myself up, and then I went like. Obviously, I shifted back into you, but then I fucking pushed myself forward. I tried tightening it a little more. I should have been tighter from the beginning. Yeah. That was kind of on me. It's all good.
Wrapping yourself takes so much fucking energy out of you. It does. <laughs> fucking nasty ass leg pump. Off of doing a rep with fucking 662, bro. Shit. Dude, I wonder what my legs would look like with a fucking. Like a fucking, uh. Like an actual fucking. What the fuck am I trying to say? Actual like bodybuilding day would be fucking crazy. Alright YouTube, pretty good uh, squat session today. Um, I didn't, um, let me, uh, I zoomed in, out, yeah. I didn't fucking uh, do a lot of commentary. I figured I was going to do my top set and then fucking do some like um, accessories like leg extension, like curls and shit like that. But it fucking, we've been down here, it was like 12 we got down here, and it's like 2.30 right now. It's not even like we were lifting the whole time, it was just switching all the plates on and off and fucking me getting my, me wrapping my knees and fucking taking rest to hit the heavy, heavy singles because I'm trying to hit my 7 something before I turn 16 August 3rd, so. Hit 662, the, um, the 560 I misgrooved it, you could see I went like backwards, um, that was kind of a mis miscommunication with the spotter. I told him to keep my chest up, but my chest was already up and he pulled back just to, so I didn't roll, like so my back didn't roll, but that kind of fucked us up, but we got it up, we got forward, and then 662, the first time I tried it, fucking failed. Um, I think I just fucking, I don't know, everything felt great, I don't know why. Second time I did it, fucking got it. Um, <sighs> Yeah, and then the other sets before that were fine, fucking, but, yeah, 662, high bar, in the basement, so, next time I do a heavy squat single, I'm going to try to hit seven, 700, either down here or in the, in the gym, it doesn't matter, I just want to hit it before I turn 16, and once I do that, hopefully I do that, like, fuck, I'm fucking dying right now, uh, hopefully I do that before, uh, like the third week of July, We're in, or, or I do it in the third week of July, and then I want to fucking hit it like fucking eight or eight plate box squat, so like 765 or something. Um, um, bench, I want to get 405. I think I think I have that. Like I could do that definitely now. Um, like not right now, but you know what I'm saying. Um, because I fucking yeah, 357 the other day for double was good. I could have got three or four, but it was just in my head. Had the number two reps in my head, so I fucking fucked myself on that too. But that was still that was still good, especially for no lift off or anything like that. No one here, it was really good. Um, trying to think, I don't know if I'm gonna fucking do deadlifts because I haven't done trap bar. Um, haven't done. I don't know if I want to do straight bar. If it fucks with my back, I think I'm just gonna do trap bar because I fucking straight bar always rapes my back, and I'm just not about that. Um. I don't know, rack pull, maybe I'll try to get fucking, put it up another 100 pound, 900 something. I'll just do that, just cause, but I'm not gonna count that in my total. Um, <sighs> let me think. Oh man, let me freaking think right now. Oh yeah, freaking overhead press. I wanna hit like, I just ripped that. I wanna hit like, um, two. Damn, I keep ripping eyes, bro. I got a fucking um, overhead press. I want to hit like 250 to 315. Close grip. I want to hit 315. I don't think I have any other goals. I think those are my oh incline 315, 350. Um, I did two, 255 for like eight or no six. I'm capping. I did it for six the other time, but after the 357 bench, so I could probably hit. I just gotta figure out the days I'm maxing on these things, and I don't know if I'm maxing on incline, but shoulder press I'll probably fucking figure out a day for that. 
and fucking do that. Um, and then close grip, I'll do that on random ass day. Um, might just do it the day I bench four plates. And then the next chest day after that, I'll do the, I, I think 300 something pounds on overhead press would be more impressive than incline. So I'll probably do that. Squat, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get the 700 all day. 662 right now. I keep getting strength. I keep getting strong, so I'm gonna keep that up. And rack pulls, I could probably put on another 100, maybe even another 200 pounds on that 806. Um, because I'm just fucking built built weird as hell. I just fucking put on put on strength quick. I wish I put size on like that. Man, be fucking massive. I do not put on size at all. I'm like eating eight to nine thousand calories a day. I'll, I'm gonna do a day of eating soon too, but um, fucking that shit is. I'm getting strong as shit as you guys can see. Putting fucking fifty, hundred pounds on my lifts right now. Just boom, 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 boom every fucking day. But um, I need to put on mat. I want to put on mass, even though like, usually boxing and shit, you don't want to be fucking big like that. But I just want to be fucking two hundred pounds. And I feel like I could still be super quick and fucking feel like I still could move good at that weight. So, I don't know. I'm just going up to there anyways. And if it's shit, then I'll just cut down and fucking whatever. But as long as I stay lean, I think I'll be pretty good. Even if I don't, I'm not lean and I'm a little fluff. I don't always cut down and keep bulking up and shit. But uh, tomorrow I think I'm going to do 225 for a rep out on bench. My chest is super sore from boxing every day. But, um... Yeah, I don't know if there might be sparring. I think the sparring Saturday, so I'll film that. Um, hopefully, I do pretty good. Um, kind of sore. I don't know how my legs are gonna be, but um, try my best. Try to fucking get my technique look sharp in the ring. Um, that's all I really gotta say right now. It's like 2:40 already, and I gotta, I got, wanna get to the fucking boxing gym around four. I gotta eat a pound of fucking beef. Um, a pound of, I don't know, I think I eat a half a pound of rice. And then the rest is a fucking peanut butter I didn't eat this morning. And then I gotta bring food to the boxing gym with me. It's a lot. And then I got boxing class, 7 to 8. So if I get there at like 4.30, that'll be, I'll have some time to do my own thing. Um, I'll film that, I'll film boxing too. Um, one of my buddies at the boxing gym told me I should start filming boxing so I was like fuck it you know I'll just film boxing too so film boxing um today it's probably gonna be a, I don't know probably not as good as a workout probably do uh, it would probably be a good workout just not as much as I usually do so I'll probably just do three rounds heavy bag three rounds shadow boxing three rounds jump rope three rounds speed bag three rounds slip bag or actually I'll probably do shadow boxing slip bag speed bag or jump rope then speed bag and then neck rolls and abs um but I don't know how it's going to be. Um, <sighs> yeah, I have no clue. Usually I, want, I try to do six rounds on the heavy bag. Three rounds regular. Three rounds jabbing. Just jabbing. Six rounds shadow boxing. Five rounds jump rope. Three rounds speed bag. Three rounds slip bag. And then fucking... If I do all that, I usually won't do my neck rolls and abs. But since I'm doing like less sets, I guess, I'm going to do fucking... Neck rolls and abs today and shit, hopefully. But yeah, that's all I got to say, guys. Peace out. Love you.